Have you ever found yourself yearning for inner peace and spiritual fulfillment, yet feeling overwhelmed by the cacophony of modern life? Have you ever wondered how to navigate the complexities of existence with grace and authenticity? If so, then join us on a transformative journey of self-discovery and personal growth. In this captivating video, we delve into the timeless wisdom gleaned from the profound journey of a disciple seeking enlightenment. Through his trials and tribulations, we uncover invaluable lessons on embracing inner silence, listening to our inner voice, and finding solace in solitude. We explore the transformative power of change, the value of humility, and the importance of mindful communication in fostering deeper connections with ourselves and others. Join us as we unravel the secrets to cultivating greater inner peace, wisdom, and fulfillment. Discover how incorporating these profound insights into your life can lead to a deeper sense of purpose and clarity. Don't miss out on this opportunity to embark on a journey of self-discovery and personal evolution. Watch until the end to unlock the keys to unlocking your true potential and living a life of profound meaning and fulfillment. Before we begin, I would appreciate it. If you liked the video, you can help me continue spreading the teachings of Buddhist and Zen stories. If you are not subscribed, I recommend you subscribe and activate the bell to avoid missing any videos. As we embark on the journey of exploring those lessons, kindly comment below with the corresponding lesson number if you find these teachings helpful. Now, let's begin. In a quaint village nestled amidst serene landscapes, there stood a grand hermitage, the abode of Gotham Buddha, a renowned Buddhist monk revered for his wisdom and enlightenment. Within the tranquil confines of this hermitage dwelled a diverse community of disciples, each seeking spiritual guidance and growth under the benevolent tutelage of the esteemed monk. Among the disciples there was one whose tongue seemed ever restless, ceaselessly weaving tales and anecdotes from dawn till dusk. Whether in the pursuit of arms or engaged in communal chores, this disciple was never short of words. Yet beneath the veneer of his eloquence lurked a darker trait, a penchant for gossip and backbiting. He would often regale his fellow disciples with tales tinged with malice, seeking to elevate himself while subtly undermining others. Sensing the discordant notes in the harmony of his disciples, Gotham Buddha called upon them one fateful day to embark on a transformative journey of self-discipline. With a gentle yet firm demeanor, he tasked each disciple with crafting a resolution to be upheld for the ensuing month. This period of self-imposed restraint was intended to fortify their resolve, fostering inner strength and self-awareness. Eager to distinguish himself, the loquacious disciple approached the revered monk with lofty aspirations. Grant me a resolution befitting my stature, he implored, craving a challenge worthy of his perceived greatness. In response, Gotham Buddha, with a serene countenance, proposed a seemingly simple yet profound decree to maintain absolute silence for the month. Initially taken aback by the apparent ease of the task, the disciple reluctantly acquiesced, albeit harboring doubts about its efficacy. Little did he anticipate the tumultuous journey that lay ahead as the cacophony of his inner turmoil echoed louder than any spoken word. In the ensuing days, the disciple grappled with the weight of his silence, grappling with a torrent of thoughts and emotions that threatened to overwhelm his resolve. Each passing moment brought with it a mounting sense of unease as the deafening silence enveloped him in its suffocating embrace. As the days turned into weeks, the disciples' inner turmoil reached a crescendo, manifesting in physical malaise and spiritual unrest. Besieged by doubts and insecurities, he sought solace in the presence of his revered mentor, desperate for guidance amidst the storm raging within. With infinite compassion, Gotham Buddha gently reminded him of the inherent struggles of the human condition, urging him to embrace the transformative power of silence. In the stillness of your silence lies the key to self-discovery, he intoned, offering a beacon of hope amidst the darkness. Buoyed by the wisdom of his master, the disciple embarked on a journey of introspection, seeking refuge in the sanctuary of solitude. Amidst the tranquil embrace of nature, 
he found respite from the ceaseless chatter of his mind, discovering a profound sense of peace that had long eluded him. As the month drew to a close, the disciple emerged from his self-imposed exile, transformed in both body and spirit. Though his voice remained silent, his newfound serenity spoke volumes, resonating with a clarity that transcended mere words. In the hallowed halls of the hermitage, the disciple's silent vigil served as a testament to the transformative power of self-discipline and introspection. His journey, though fraught with challenges, had ultimately led him to the threshold of enlightenment, where silence spoke louder than any words could ever convey. And in the gentle smile of Gotham Buddha, he found the reassurance that his silent resolve had not been in vain. As he turned away from the hut, a palpable sense of relief washed over him, accompanied by a newfound tranquility that had long eluded him. Embracing the silence, he immersed himself in the serenity of his surroundings, savoring each moment of respite from the incessant chatter that had once consumed his days. Yet, as the hours stretched into days, the weight of his silence began to bear down upon him with increasing intensity. With each passing moment, the burden grew heavier, gnawing at his conscience and stirring a tempest of conflicting emotions within him. By the third day of his vow of silence, a sense of unease crept over him, a nagging discomfort that refused to be ignored. As the ceaseless banter of his fellow disciples filled the air around him, he found himself longing to join in, to share his thoughts and opinions with those around him. If you are still watching this video and find these lessons useful, please comment number one below to let me know that you are still watching this video with me. But as the desire to speak tugged at his soul, his resolve remained steadfast, a silent sentinel guarding against the temptation to break his vow. In the depths of his anguish, he sought solace in the presence of his revered mentor, desperate for guidance in navigating the tumult raging within him. Seated before the wise sage, he poured out his heart in silent supplication, his words etched upon parchment in a plea for clarity and reprieve. Buddhist monk, he wrote, I want to speak. I can't bear this silence any longer. My mind is in turmoil and I fear I am losing my sanity. What should I do? Should I abandon my resolution? In response, the monk's countenance softened with understanding, his gentle smile a beacon of reassurance amidst the disciples' inner turmoil. Resolutions are but fleeting shadows, easily broken and forgotten, he intoned. Yet, in the act of upholding them lies the seeds of inner strength and self-discovery. With gentle wisdom, he reminded the disciple of the power that lay within his grasp, urging him to confront the challenges of the present moment with unwavering resolve. The decision rests in your hands, he counseled. Choose wisely, for the path you tread today will shape the course of your tomorrow. With a heavy heart, the disciple retreated to the sanctuary of his humble abode, seeking solace in the solitude of his thoughts. For days on end, he remained ensconced within the confines of his hut, emerging only to attend to his most basic needs, his silent vigil a testament to the strength of his resolve. As the days turned into weeks, the hushed whispers of the ashram echoed with speculation and wonder at the disciples' steadfast silence. Yet, amidst the quietude, a tempest raged within him as the cacophony of his inner turmoil threatened to drown out the serenity of his resolve. Seeking counsel once more, he sought out the sage's wisdom, his words a silent plea for guidance amidst the tumult of his thoughts. Buddhist monk, he wrote, I am silent outwardly, but within me a storm rages unabated. Is my resolve still intact? In response, the monk's gentle gaze bore into the depths of the disciple's soul, his words a balm to soothe the ache of uncertainty. Your resolve remains steadfast, he affirmed, yet true silence lies not in the absence of words, but in the stillness of the heart. Embrace the chaos within, and you shall find peace without. With renewed clarity, the disciple embarked once more upon the path of self-discovery, his silent vigil a testament to the transformative power of inner strength and resilience. 
And as he journeyed onward, guided by the wisdom of his mentor, he found solace in the silent symphony of his soul, a melody of peace that echoed across the vast expanse of his being. The disciple, grappling with the turmoil within, found solace in the monk's words, though the journey towards inner silence seemed fraught with challenges. With a heart heavy yet determined, he bid farewell to the hermitage, embarking on a solitary sojourn into the forest's depths. Days turned into weeks, and the passage of time blurred into an indistinct haze as the disciple traversed the verdant expanse of the wilderness. Amidst the rustling of leaves and the gentle murmur of streams, he sought refuge from the ceaseless clamor of his mind, yearning to transcend the confines of his thoughts. As the month drew to a close, the disciples of the ashram awaited the return of their erstwhile companion with bated breath, yet no sign of his presence graced the horizon. Fears of his fate at the mercy of prowling beasts whispered through the halls of the hermitage, casting a pall of apprehension over the tranquil abode. Amidst the prevailing uncertainty, the Buddhist monk maintained a steadfast resolve, sensing a deeper truth underlying the disciple's prolonged absence. When questioned by a fellow devotee regarding the fate of the wayward disciple, the monk offered a perspective steeped in wisdom and insight. The animals may have made him their prey, conceded the monk, his voice imbued with a serene certainty. But there could be another reason for his non-return. Perhaps he sought something beyond the confines of our hermitage, a truth hidden amidst the depths of the forest. The disciples' prolonged silence, far from a mere absence of words, resonated with the profound depths of human experience. It spoke to the inherent struggle of humanity to find solace amidst the incessant clamor of existence, to transcend the limitations of language and to commune with the silent wisdom of the natural world. In response to the disciples' query regarding the perils of excessive speech, the monk offered a poignant reflection on the nature of human interaction. He spoke of the inherent difficulty in remaining silent, of the constant need to fill the void with words even when silence might hold greater wisdom. It is often said that one of the many difficulties of being human is the inability to remain silent, mused the monk, his words carrying the weight of centuries of introspection, we constantly feel the need to speak, even when it is not necessary or when it may lead to negative consequences. If you are still watching this video and find these lessons useful, please comment number two below to let me know that you are still watching this video with me. With each passing moment, the disciples journey into silence mirrored the broader human struggle to find meaning amidst the cacophony of existence. In the hallowed halls of the hermitage, his absence served as a poignant reminder of the fleeting nature of human existence and the imperative to seek solace amidst the silence that lies beyond. The disciples, grappling with the profound wisdom imparted by the Buddhist monk, sought further elucidation on the path to inner peace. Then what is the solution, they implored, their voices tinged with a yearning for guidance amidst the tumult of their thoughts, in response, the monk, with a serene countenance, offered a timeless truth encapsulated in his gentle words. This is the only way, he intoned, to watch your thoughts with full awareness, contemplating all mental problems by staying in the present and doing your work with full awareness brings miraculous changes in life. With hearts alight with newfound understanding, the disciples bowed in reverence before their venerable teacher, grateful for the clarity bestowed upon them. Armed with this timeless wisdom, they ventured forth into the world, each committed to treading the path of mindfulness and self-awareness. As the days stretched into weeks and the weeks into months, the ashram remained shrouded in the tranquil embrace of solitude, the absence of the wayward disciple cast a somber pall over the serene atmosphere. His departure left an indelible void in the hearts of his fellow devotees. Yet just when hope seemed to wane, a glimmer of light pierced through the veil of uncertainty, heralding the long-awaited return of the prodigal disciple.
His countenance, once marred by the tumult of inner strife, now radiated with an ineffable calmness, his eyes ablaze with the fire of enlightenment. As he crossed the threshold of the ashram, a chorus of joyous exclamations greeted him, the air filled with the palpable energy of anticipation. The disciples, drawn like moths to a flame, surrounded him, eager to bask in the aura of his newfound serenity. Conversations flowed like gentle streams, each word imbued with the profound wisdom gleaned from the disciples' transformative journey. Gone was the impatience and restlessness that once defined him, replaced by a quiet confidence that spoke volumes of his inner growth. In a moment of profound humility, the disciple approached the Buddhist monk, his heart brimming with gratitude for the guidance bestowed upon him. Am I still silent? Is my resolution still on? He queried, his voice barely above a whisper. With a gentle nod, the monk affirmed the disciple's silent resolve, his eyes reflecting the depth of his understanding. Yes, you are still silent, he murmured. Not a single word is coming out of your mouth, and your resolution is still on. Moved by the monk's affirmation, the disciple recounted his journey, revealing the inner turmoil that once plagued his soul. When I left the ashram, he confessed, I was silent with my mouth, but there were many voices inside me, there were many questions in my mind, and they were not stopping. In this moment of vulnerability, the disciple laid bare the innermost recesses of his being, his words a testament to the transformative power of self-awareness and mindfulness. As the sun dipped below the horizon, casting a warm glow upon the tranquil ashram, the disciples gathered around their beloved teacher, united in their pursuit of enlightenment and inner peace. Thus, with a heavy heart and a yearning for inner peace, I ventured into the depths of the forest, seeking respite from the ceaseless chatter of my mind. Amidst the towering trees and the gentle rustle of leaves, I hoped to find solace, a sanctuary where the cacophony of my thoughts would finally subside. Yet, to my dismay, the solitude of the forest only served to amplify the clamor within me. The echoes of past grievances and self-righteousness reverberated through the corridors of my mind, casting a shadow over the serenity of my surroundings. In the quiet expanse of the forest, stripped of the distractions of everyday life, I confronted the harsh reality of my shortcomings. The words I once spoke with conviction now rang hollow, their echoes mocking my misguided sense of superiority. It was a sobering realization, one that filled me with a profound sense of remorse and humility. For too long I had allowed the voices of ego and pride to drown out the whispers of wisdom and compassion. Yet, amidst the turmoil of self-reflection, a subtle shift occurred within me. Like the gentle rustle of leaves in the breeze, the cacophony of my thoughts began to fade, replaced by an overwhelming sense of stillness and clarity. In the embrace of silence, I found a profound sense of peace, unlike any I had experienced before. The tumult of my mind gave way to the harmonious symphony of nature, the gentle rustle of leaves, the melodious chirping of birds and the soothing murmur of flowing water. With each passing moment, I savored the exquisite beauty of the present, basking in the tranquility that enveloped me like a warm embrace. And though the urge to break the silence tugged at my consciousness, I resisted, determined to preserve the fragile serenity that had enveloped me. If you are still watching this video and find these lessons useful, please comment on number three below to let me know that you are still watching this video with me. In a moment of defiance, I raised my voice to the heavens, questioning the nature of this newfound peace. Yet, even as my words echoed through the stillness of the forest, they were met with a resounding silence, undisturbed by the tumult of my inquiry. For in that moment I realized that true peace resided not in the absence of noise, but in the profound stillness that lay at the heart of existence. As I stood amidst the tranquil embrace of the forest, I knew that I had discovered a sanctuary within myself, a refuge from the chaos of the world outside. In response to the disciples' poignant revelation, the Buddhist monk listened attentively, his gaze filled with empathy and understanding. 
With gentle yet profound wisdom, he addressed the inner turmoil that plagued the disciple's soul. My dear disciple, the monk began, his voice a soothing balm to the restless spirit, your experience is a testament to the profound truth within each of us. Though outwardly engaged in conversation and observation, it is within the depths of our being that true solitude and silence are found. The monk's words resonated deeply within the disciple's heart, offering a profound insight into the nature of inner peace amidst the chaos of the external world. With each syllable, the monk illuminated the path to serenity, guiding the disciple towards a deeper understanding of the self. In the clamor of the external world, we often find ourselves caught in a cycle of incessant chatter, the monk continued, his voice imbued with quiet authority. Yet it is in the silence of our minds that true tranquility is found, for it is here, in the stillness of our inner being, that we discover the boundless depths of our existence. The monk's words echoed like a clarion call, cutting through the noise of the disciples' thoughts and illuminating the path to inner peace. With each passing moment, the disciple felt a profound sense of clarity wash over him, as if a veil had been lifted from his eyes, revealing the inherent beauty of the present moment. Indeed, my dear disciple, the monk affirmed, his voice filled with conviction, the root of much suffering in this world lies in our inability to embrace the silence within. We speak out of fear, seeking validation and understanding from others, yet in doing so, we only perpetuate our sense of disconnection. As the monk spoke, a sense of clarity descended upon the disciple, illuminating the path to true liberation from the shackles of the ego. With each word, the monk offered a beacon of hope, guiding the disciple toward a deeper understanding of the self and the world around him. In the pursuit of inner peace, we must learn to quiet the incessant chatter of the mind, the monk declared, his words resonating with the weight of timeless wisdom, for it is only in the silence of our hearts that we discover the true essence of our being. With a sense of profound gratitude, the disciple bowed before the monk, his heart overflowing with reverence and awe. In that sacred moment, he understood that true wisdom lay not in the words themselves, but in the silence that lingered between them. 1. Embrace inner silence. In the bustling cacophony of modern life, where screens flicker incessantly and notifications clamor for attention, the importance of embracing inner silence cannot be overstated. Amidst the hustle and bustle, finding moments of solitude becomes paramount for our mental, emotional and spiritual well-being. In the sanctuary of inner silence, we discover a refuge from the relentless chatter of external stimuli. Here, amidst the stillness of our minds, we can peel back the layers of distraction to uncover the true essence of our being. It is in these quiet moments of introspection that we find the clarity and insight needed to navigate life's complexities with grace and wisdom. By turning inward and quieting the mind, we create space for deep reflection and self-discovery. In the gentle hush of inner silence, we can hear the whispers of our intuition and connect with our deepest truths. This sacred communion with the self fosters a sense of inner peace and harmony that permeates every aspect of our lives. Moreover, embracing inner silence allows us to cultivate a profound connection to ourselves. In the absence of external noise and distractions, we can listen to the rhythm of our heartbeat and feel the stirrings of our souls. This intimate connection nourishes our sense of self-awareness and empowers us to live authentically in alignment with our values and aspirations. 2. Listen to your inner voice. The narrative underscores a timeless truth. Amidst the clamor of external influences, our inner voice serves as a steadfast guide, illuminating the path to authenticity and self-awareness. In a world inundated with noise and distraction, it is easy to lose sight of our true selves amid the cacophony of external opinions and expectations. Yet the story reminds us of the profound wisdom that resides within each of us, a wisdom that beckons us to listen attentively to the whispers of our intuition. Listening to our inner voice is akin to tapping into a reservoir of boundless wisdom and insight. 
It is a practice that invites us to cultivate a deeper sense of self-awareness and understanding. Through attentive listening, we can discern the subtle nuances of our emotions, desires and aspirations, gaining clarity amidst the complexities of life's journey. Moreover, honoring our inner voice empowers us to navigate life's challenges with grace and resilience. In moments of uncertainty or adversity, our intuition serves as a compass, guiding us toward choices and decisions that are aligned with our highest good. By trusting in the wisdom of our inner guidance, we can traverse even the most treacherous terrain with confidence and conviction. Furthermore, listening to our inner voice fosters a sense of authenticity and integrity in our interactions with the world. When we heed the call of our intuition, we honor our unique perspective and values, standing firmly in our truth. This authenticity radiates outward, infusing our relationships and endeavors with sincerity and depth. If you're still watching this video and find these lessons useful, please comment number four below to let me know that you are still watching this video with me. Three, value of self-reflection. In the tapestry of life, moments of self-reflection serve as the threads that weave together the fabric of our existence. Just as the disciple ventured into the forest to embark on a journey of self-discovery, so too can we benefit from the transformative power of introspection and self-examination. Amidst the hustle and bustle of our daily lives, carving out time for quiet contemplation allows us to delve beneath the surface of our thoughts and emotions, unveiling hidden truths and illuminating the path to personal growth and understanding. Self-reflection is an art, a sacred practice that invites us to turn inward and gaze upon the landscape of our inner world with curiosity and compassion. Through the gentle inquiry of introspection, we explore the depths of our being, plumbing the depths of our thoughts, beliefs and desires. In this sacred space of self-discovery, we encounter the full spectrum of our humanity, the light and the shadow, the joy and the sorrow, the triumphs and the trials. Moreover, self-reflection offers a mirror through which we can examine the patterns and tendencies that shape our lives. By observing our thoughts, emotions and behaviors with mindful awareness, we gain valuable insight into the root causes of our joys and our struggles. This process of self-inquiry empowers us to identify areas for growth and transformation, enabling us to cultivate greater resilience, clarity and purpose in our lives. Furthermore, self-reflection fosters a deeper connection to ourselves and the world around us, as we peel back the layers of conditioning and societal expectations, we uncover the essence of our true selves, the radiant spark of divinity that resides within each of us. In this sacred space of self-knowing, we find solace and strength, anchoring ourselves in the unshakable truth of our inherent worth and dignity. For Mindful communication. Within the tapestry of human interaction, the art of communication serves as both a bridge and a barrier to understanding. The story poignantly underscores the pitfalls of excessive talking and the transformative power of mindful communication. In a world where words flow freely and communication channels abound, it is all too easy to succumb to the allure of incessant chatter, unwittingly sowing seeds of discord and misunderstanding, Mindful communication invites us to pause, reflect, and imbue our words with intention and awareness. It is a practice rooted in the art of listening, of truly hearing and understanding the perspectives of others before offering our own. By cultivating a deep sense of presence and receptivity, we create space for authentic dialogue and meaningful connection to flourish. Moreover, mindful communication encourages us to speak with purpose and clarity, choosing our words thoughtfully and consciously. Rather than succumbing to the impulse to fill the silence with idle chatter, we honor the sanctity of speech by using it as a tool for upliftment and connection. In doing so, we harness the power of language to inspire, to heal, and to bridge the divides that separate us. Furthermore, mindful communication fosters empathy and compassion, allowing us to navigate the complexities of human relationships with grace and understanding.
by attuning ourselves to the nuances of non-verbal cues and subtle gestures, we deepen our capacity for empathy and forge deeper bonds of trust and mutual respect. 5. Seek solitude. In the hustle and bustle of modern existence, amidst the constant barrage of stimuli and distractions, the concept of solitude emerges as a beacon of serenity and self-discovery, much like the revered Buddhas of ancient lore, who retreated into the tranquil embrace of solitude to attain enlightenment, we too can glean invaluable insights and spiritual nourishment by intentionally carving out moments of seclusion in our lives. Solitude, in its myriad forms, offers a sacred sanctuary, a haven where the cacophony of the external world gradually fades into the background, allowing the gentle whispers of our innermost thoughts and emotions to resonate with clarity and resonance. Whether it be through the practice of meditation in the quiet confines of our homes, strolls amidst the verdant splendor of nature, or moments of introspective solitude spent in silent contemplation, each instance of solitude presents us with a precious opportunity to embark on an inward journey of self-discovery and introspection. Moreover, within the hallowed sanctuary of solitude, we find ourselves enveloped in a profound sense of tranquility and peace, a respite from the relentless demands and pressures of the external world. It is amidst the tranquil embrace of solitude that we discover the freedom to shed the layers of pretense and social conditioning, allowing our authentic selves to emerge unencumbered by external expectations or societal norms. Furthermore, solitude serves as a crucible for personal growth and spiritual nourishment, providing us with the necessary space and stillness to reflect upon the deeper truths of existence and ponder life's profound mysteries. In the gentle hush of solitude, we cultivate a heightened sense of self-awareness and introspection, enabling us to navigate life's vicissitudes with grace and equanimity. If you are still watching this video and find these lessons useful, please comment on number 5 below to let me know that you are still watching this video with me. 6. Value of Humility The poignant tale of the disciples' transformative journey serves as a powerful reminder of the profound value of humility in our lives. Embedded within the narrative lies a timeless lesson a testament to the virtues of self-awareness, introspection, and the willingness to acknowledge our limitations. At its core, humility beckons us to relinquish the cloak of pride and ego, inviting us to embrace a stance of openness and receptivity towards the world around us. The disciple's initial hubris manifested through his incessant chatter and self-aggrandizement serves as a cautionary tale, an illustration of the pitfalls that accompany arrogance and self-importance. Yet, as he embarks on his solitary sojourn into the depths of the forest, he is confronted with the stark reality of his inner turmoil, a humbling revelation that shatters the veneer of his perceived superiority. Through the crucible of introspection and self-reflection, the disciple begins to unravel the layers of his ego, peeling back the facade of pride to reveal the raw vulnerability that lies beneath. In the tranquil embrace of solitude, stripped of external validations and societal expectations, he is compelled to confront the truth of his fallibility, a humbling realization that catalyzes his spiritual metamorphosis. In this journey towards self-discovery, humility emerges as a guiding beacon, an unwavering compass that directs our path toward growth and self-improvement. It is through the lens of humility that we gain insight into our limitations and imperfections, fostering a sense of empathy and understanding towards others. Moreover, humility cultivates a spirit of receptivity, an openness to new experiences, perspectives and wisdom. By acknowledging our fallibility, we create space for growth and learning, recognizing that true wisdom arises not from a position of arrogance, but from a place of humility and openness to the teachings of others. Ultimately, the disciple's journey serves as a poignant reminder that humility is not a sign of weakness, but rather a testament to inner strength and resilience, 
It is through the practice of humility that we forge deeper connections with ourselves and with others, fostering a sense of unity and compassion that transcends the barriers of ego. 7. Embrace Change Embedded within the narrative of the disciples' journey lies a profound testament to the transformative power of change, a poignant reminder that life is a perpetual journey of growth, evolution and self-discovery. As the disciple traverses the winding path of his spiritual odyssey, he bears witness to the inexorable tide of change that sweeps through the fabric of existence, reshaping perceptions, beliefs and identities along its tumultuous course. At its essence, change serves as the crucible through which we have forged anew, a catalyst for personal and spiritual evolution that propels us towards greater depths of understanding, wisdom and self-realization. The disciples' initial reluctance to embrace change is a reflection of the inherent discomfort that accompanies the unfamiliar and the unknown. Yet, as he surrenders to the ebb and flow of life's ceaseless currents, he discovers within himself an untapped reservoir of resilience and adaptability, a testament to the inherent capacity for growth and transformation that resides within each of us. Through the lens of change, we are allowed to shed the shackles of complacency and stagnation, daring to venture beyond the confines of our comfort zones in pursuit of new horizons and undiscovered vistas. It is in the crucible of change that we are compelled to confront our deepest fears and insecurities, challenging us to relinquish outdated paradigms and embrace the boundless potential of the unknown. Moreover, change catalyzes renewal, a sacred alchemy that transmutes the leaden weight of past experiences into the golden wisdom of the present moment. Like the phoenix rising from the ashes, we emerge from the crucible of change reborn, revitalized and imbued with a newfound sense of purpose and clarity. In embracing change, we embark upon a journey of self-discovery and personal growth, an odyssey that transcends the confines of time and space, leading us toward the luminous shores of self-realization and spiritual fulfillment. As we navigate the ever-shifting tides of existence, let us heed the timeless wisdom of the disciples' journey, embracing change as an ally rather than an adversary and allowing it to unfurl the petals of our innermost potential with grace and equanimity. Incorporating these profound insights into the tapestry of our lives, we embark upon a sacred quest, a journey of self-discovery and personal evolution that leads us ever closer toward the radiant shores of inner peace, wisdom and fulfillment. Through the transformative power of change, we awaken to the boundless potential that resides within us, illuminating the path toward a brighter, more luminous future filled with infinite possibilities and untold blessings. As we draw near the conclusion of our journey together, Take a moment to reflect on the profound insights we've explored. What lessons have resonated with you the most? What revelations will you carry forward into your own life's journey? We invite you to share your thoughts in the comments below. Let us know one thing you've learned from today's video and how you plan to integrate it into your daily practice. Your insights may inspire others on their path to self-discovery and personal growth. If you found this video enriching and insightful, please show your support by leaving a comment, liking, sharing and subscribing to our YouTube channel. Your engagement fuels our mission to spread wisdom and inspiration to seekers around the globe. Thank you for joining us on this transformative journey. Until next time, may you continue to walk the path of inner peace, wisdom and fulfillment.